Question. A 24-year-old G1P0 at 38 weeks gestation presents to triage reporting a sudden gush of clear fluid from her vagina while walking at home. Upon arrival, she appears anxious and reports decreased fetal movement over the past hour. Her vitals are stable and she denies contractions. What is the nurse's first priority? A. Assess fetal heart rate via external monitor. B. Perform a sterile vaginal examination to check cervical status. C. Inspect the perineum for signs of meconium stained fluid. D. Initiate IV fluids for hydration and labor preparation. Answer. A. Assess fetal heart rate via external monitor. Rationale. A sudden gush of fluid likely indicates rupture of membranes and decreased fetal movement raises concern for cord prolapse or fetal distress. The immediate priority is to assess fetal well-being using electronic fetal monitoring. A prolapsed cord or compromised circulation could lead to hypoxia. Vaginal exams are delayed until fetal status is confirmed to avoid worsening a possible prolapse. Inspection of fluid and initiation of iVersus are important, but only after confirming fetal safety.